Hi everybody, just another quick video uh, on my BT uh, full fibre broadband service. This is the um, network termination point or modem if you like uh, that's inside the house. So this connects to the ONT on the outside of the house. Um, I've done another little video on that if you want to see what that looks like. But this is what OpenReach installs uh, inside the house. Uh, mine is just in a small utility cupboard, so you can see here uh, the uh, cables come up through this uh, conduit, which I put in uh, with a cable gland on the top. That was just to stop uh, any of the cables getting snagged. And then uh, they mount the box on the wall, pretty much wherever you want it. So just a quick, uh, quick measure up. So it's about nine centimeters uh, high. Uh, I think it's about eight and a half centimetres, eight centimetres wide, and looking at that, it's two and a half centimetres out from the wall. You do need to have it mounted somewhere where there's power, a plug socket. So I put this metal clad uh, socket here specifically uh, so that I could have the network termination point tucked away in this utility cupboard. Uh, as you can see, there are three lights or four lights on the top. You don't want this one on, but you've got the power light on the left. Uh, the next one is LOS or loss of service. If that comes on, you've got no signal, so you've got problems. So if that's off, that's good. Um, so you want the uh, the PON light on and then the LAN light. So the LAN light shows it's connected to the router. Uh, mine's not connected to a BT router. I've got mine connected to an ASUS router. So the cables that come in uh, on the left, there's only three ports underneath. So this is the power. Uh, that's coming from uh, this socket so there's the power the next one is an rj45 so this one for me goes uh, to another room in the house where i've got my my router um, but if you've got the bt hub same lead ethernet cable would go to the bt um, hub and then the one on the right this is the fiber optic cable uh, that comes from the uh, ONT which is mounted on outside the house into here so very simple setup quite small tucked away um, and as I say open reach are really good they'll fit this anywhere in the house that you want to so before you order have a little think about where you want things uh, to make sure it's convenient for where you want to place your uh, your router um, so what I might do is do another video at some point on uh, the various error signals that you can get via different colored lights, whether they're solid, whether they're blinking. Uh, I'll do that in a, in a separate um, video. I think there are a number of these, just thinking about it. This one, I believe, is made by Nokia. I think there are three or four other manufacturers that, uh, that BT use. Uh, but I think this one seems to be uh, seems to be the most common. Really small, um, tucks away quite nicely. Anyway, I hope that helps. Uh, if you like the video, please consider subscribing and uh, maybe even smashing that uh, notification button uh, for future videos. Anyway, see you in the next one. Bye for now.